For this week's video, I'm going to be showing you some good quality extensions for a very good price. So if you want to know more, stay tuned. For this video, I'm going to be showing you some hair extensions that I got sent to me. This company emailed me and they asked me to do a review on their extensions. I was a little bit hesitant at first, but I looked up the brand, I saw that they were on Amazon and they had their own website, and I was like, you know what, I'll just try it because I love trying new things, so I decided to say yes. And the company that I'm talking about today is called Merit, I think? I am horrible with pronunciating, you already know this. This is the box that they came in. It's a really pretty box. It looks like almost like a paint smear, just like across the box with like gold writing, which I love. So this is the name of the brand. I'll also put it up here just so you can read it. But these are a 100% Remy hair. Thicker, longer, natural looking. That's what it says on the box. They also have a little website that you can go look at. So in this video, I'm gonna be unboxing. And I unboxed on a different day than today. But I decided after I unboxed it, I tried them on and that video for with me putting them in was just not it. So I decided to take a whole different video for just me putting the extensions in. I thought this would just be a fun video to do because I love hair extensions. But yeah, without me constantly talking, let's get into this video. This is the box that it came in. I think it's super cute. Like I love the little shiny part for their name. It's pink, which I love. I love pink. Also, they have like cape that has their company name on it, which I think is really cute. I love cute packaging, so this is already good in my books. Okay. So I'm just taking off that little sticker. And this is I love that. Okay, so opening this box, this is what it looks like. I love the chrome of it. That reminds me of the Just For Kiara contacts. Okay, so the first things that I see in this box, it came with like a little barrette that's super sparkly. Oh, right up my alley. It has a little instruction book on how to put different hair extensions in. And then just like a little after sales card. I don't know what that is. I think it's just like a little business card. Now let's get to the extensions. Oh my goodness. And it comes with a little comb. Okay, before I open the extensions, I'm just gonna, aw, this is so nice. I like that. I feel like these kind of combs are so handy. It's so easy to section your hair with these. Oh, I love that. So, oh my God, I love that. Look at how pretty that is. What nice packaging. I love when people go the extra mile for that kind of stuff. So it comes with some extra clips. So it comes in a little thing like this. I got the dark brown 22 inch extent clip-in extensions. I got the clip-in extensions because I already have halo extensions, so I just wanted to try something different this time. So I guess we shall see how this looks. Okay, so I originally wanted to do this whole video in just one go, but unfortunately, that's not what happened. So when I unboxed it, I did put the extensions in and I tried them on, but my hair was kind of greasy that day, so I didn't really like how it looked, and then just like the whole process of putting the extensions into my hair. I don't know, it's my first time using clip-in extensions, so I'm gonna redo this part. But earlier when I was unboxing it, I wanted to keep that part in because I feel like it was super authentic. That was actually me unboxing the whole box and seeing it for the first time, so I just wanted to keep that part in. I think it's kind of funny because, of course, the day that I decided to go to the crest and I wore this shirt, I decided to record this video. I did my Lexi hair video in this shirt too. So hair extensions, I, I guess this is just my hair extension shirt. So I'm just gonna quickly show you what the extensions look like, not curled or anything. Like this is how the extensions came. 
So these are what the extensions look like. This is all of the wefts together. I feel like first touching them, they're very soft. It's a little bit crazy at the top. Like I, I'm gonna brush these before I put them in my hair. I feel like this is gonna be a pretty good color match to my hair for the most part. I do know that my hair kind of has like little parts of blonde in it still because I haven't dyed my hair since I was blonde. So I don't know if you can see it, but just like kind of at the ends of it, they're a little bit lighter. It, that might make it so it doesn't color match like perfectly, but I'm not too worried about it, especially when you have hair extensions in, if you just curl it and try to blend it out as much as possible, they usually blend pretty well. I feel like it's easier to put hair extensions in when your hair is already curled and then just curl this separately and then try to just blend them together and curl whatever needs to be curled again. So I'm just gonna be right back while I curl these. Okay, so I just finished curling the extensions, but this is what they look like. I'm just gonna quickly brush them out with this little comb that I got. Wow. I feel like these are so soft once you brush them out and they haven't shed a whole lot, which is really good. But yeah, let's just start putting these in my hair. Okay, so first things first, you just section the first part of your hair back. I'm gonna start with a three clip weft, which looks kind of like this. I'm gonna start with that, clip that in the middle of my head and then clip the other two pieces. Once the middle part's secure, it's a little bit easier to clip the rest of it in. Always knew that you were stubborn, but didn't know it'd be so hard to figure out who you really are. That first weft is in and you can already see that it kind of gives my hair quite a bit of length. Nice, nice. My chair is literally so squeaky. I don't know why it's making that sound. Maybe it needs some like WD-40 or something, but every time I move, it's like, I don't know why. Okay, so I'm gonna take my hair down and just start with another section. I think I'm going to make this section right along the middle of my head. And I feel like this is probably gonna be the longest section. So I'm gonna use the four clip weft, which I will show you in a second. So I'm gonna be using this weft next. And again, I'm just gonna clip these two middle parts in first on the back of my head and then clip these two in after. This I feel like is the longest weft that there is. So I just wanna make sure that this goes on like the thickest part of my head. This is what it looks like together so far. I think the blending is going really nicely with my hair. I'll just go a little higher so you can see. But look at how much length that already gives my hair. And that's only two clips in. Wow, oh, that's pretty. So we are going to go to the next. Okay, so I think this is gonna be the last section for the back of my head. For this section, I'm going to be using another three clip weft. So I'm gonna be using this one. So again, the middle one goes on first and then you do the second ones after. You make up your mind that I'm nowhere to find I'm standing right here I know that I told you we're over I swear that I'm sober 
I feel like this looks so much better once you style it. The first time that I did my hair and put these extensions in, it did not look this good. Styling them first made it look so much nicer and it makes it look a lot more blended. Now we are on to the sides of the hair. So this is what it looks like so far. Honestly, like this is turning out a lot better than I thought. So I'm just gonna use this little comb that they gave me. Just to section cleanly, just so I can put these next wefts in. So the next clip I'm going to be using is this two clip weft. It doesn't really matter which one you do first. I kind of like to do the first one closest to my face just so I can get a rough idea of where it's going and then clip the next one in just wherever. I think I want to add one of the one clip wefts just to this general area right here on my head. add a little bit more volume. Yeah. Okay, and then the other side. I'm gonna be using a tooth clip weft again and just And again, I'm just gonna be using one of the two clip wefts and I'm gonna start closer to my face. Just add that one on. And then put that one on. See what that looks like. And then I think I wanna add a little bit more volume just in this general area like I did up here. So I'm just gonna take this again and Section it just in this general area just because I want it to be a little bit more voluminous on the top. Add that on, lift that back over to hide it, and that is it. Well, that is what these extensions look like in my hair. Honestly, I feel like these look a lot better than I thought they were going to. These blend a lot better when you curl them first. Wow, this blending though, holy. These are actually really cute. Wow, I'm really surprised with these. I definitely wasn't expecting too much from them, but holy, I, I think I would definitely wear these. They're not super heavy on your head, which is nice. Wow. Well, that is it for this video. I want to rate these extensions just because they were sent to me and I'm giving a review on them. So I feel like I should rate them. So for softness, I would give them definitely like maybe a nine. Yeah, eight or nine, maybe even 10. I don't know. I don't want to be too nice, but these are definitely very good quality extensions, especially for the price. I feel like these are fairly cheap compared to some other brands that I've seen. So these are definitely a good kind of extension to start with if you're not really used to putting extensions in and you've never worn extensions before, but you wanna try them out. These are definitely good. I would definitely suggest these. I feel like these are a good price, especially for what you get. They are super soft. I'm really surprised, honestly. Like, I didn't think that they were gonna look this good in my hair. Yeah, these definitely look better the second time that I put these in. For shedding, these have shed a little bit. There has definitely been a little bit of shedding, but nothing too crazy, nothing to really worry about because hair extensions do shed. That's just natural for them. Not a whole lot. Big clumps of it shouldn't be coming out, but like little strands here and there are fine. Shedding is definitely normal, but they don't shed extensively, which 
which is good. The blending for these extensions, like I've talked about for the past like five, 10 minutes, I am very surprised with the blending of these. Like I did not think that they were gonna look this good. Wow, wow. If you're wondering what I'm looking at, there's a mirror right there, but I just like can't stop looking at them because I feel like, just look at this. Like you can't even really tell where my hair starts and where the extensions begin. So pretty, I, I love them. And I'll probably add them into my routine of hair extensions to wear because they're not super out there. They're not super thick or anything. They're very light on your head, but they give your hair length still, which is nice, but it's not like overwhelming. Sometimes I feel like when I wear my halo extensions, it's just like a whole lot of hair. I would definitely recommend these. I think these are perfect for someone who doesn't want to spend like hundreds and hundreds of dollars on hair extensions, but also wants hair extensions, you know? I did read in some of the comments on Google and just like on their website that if you have thicker hair, you should probably get two packs of these extensions just because they're a little bit on the thin side. My hair is like a medium kind of thickness and one pack I feel like would be enough. So that is it for this video. If you liked it, definitely go hit that like button down below. And if you like me and the videos that I do, definitely consider hitting that subscribe button down below as well. If you got this far in my video, congratulations, you're now part of the LOS gang. I try to post videos every week, so yeah, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoy, and I will see you next week. Bye!